has failed me for the last time. And we're back with another Star Wars Force Arena video. We're going to go over Luke Skywalker and Ben Kenobi, which has been generally regarded as the best rebel hero. Now, I do think Cassian is very good, may take over Luke as the best rebel light side hero. But I have played against Luke many, many, many times, and I have lost many, many times against these two guys right here. And they are pretty much Luke mains. They just use Luke constantly. And I started to try to play Luke to figure out how to do him. And I think I was at 5781, and I dropped like 400 points very quickly. So what I'm going to say is that I have found that he is very challenging to play and there are a lot of subtleties to him, but when played correctly, he's probably the best hero in the game. Let's go over his abilities, and then we'll talk about his unique old Ben, whether you should use him or not. After a consecutive cap, strikes an enemy directly ahead and reflects enemy blaster when standing still. Now, that is the real trick. When he stands still, he can reflect blasters, and there's a whole art to that, especially at the beginning of the game, where you can definitely get energy advantage by reflecting bullets back at them. It is pretty awesome. His special ability is when Ben Kenobi is defeated, Luke Skywalker damage increases by 20% for 30 seconds. This effect disappears when Luke is defeated. And then his skill slashes with his lightsaber to deal 250% attack power to damage and he's in front of him. So it kind of like swings in an arc in front of you. It can take out a whole group at once. He is very good at going at towers and suiciding and taking down towers. He is amazing. He's got a lot of health and he has very good attack power. Now... Old Ben is very controversial, and I want to say you don't need Ben Kenobi to play with Luke. In fact, some people say you're hurting your deck by putting him in them. We'll talk about that because he has this really bizarre ability, really cool, but it doesn't always work right, and because he costs 8 energy, it's not always good to put him in your deck. Ben Kenobi, once a legendary Jedi Master serving the Republic, has emerged from exile to train Luke Skywalker. He's strong in the ways of the Force with the ability to use Jedi mind tricks to influence the weak-minded and evade danger. He can steal units, but he can't steal all the units. So basically, he can't steal like a walker. And really, the only units that you want to steal are going to be the light vehicles and the heavy gunners. Those are the two units that, if you do it, You'll win the match, but they're not always there. And in fact, a lot of people won't even play Ben because he's so expensive and it doesn't always trigger. Like if you put it close to unique or a hero, it won't trigger. So you got to put it in the right spot. And unless they're using this card or this card, I don't know if it's a good card to play. So if you're playing in the arena and you're coming across those units a lot, then you want to play Old Ben. Now, in Kyber, where it was at, people are not using those two cards, probably for that reason, because it's pretty powerful with Old Ben. So, what I'm hearing is to not use him. He's actually detrimental. If you put him in your deck, you're not going to play him, and then you only have two cards to rotate through if you're not coming across those units, because I don't know if it's a good value to play at any other times. Now, that might change. He's somewhat of a controversial card. So, Eight energy, that's why. He's very expensive. It's either you lose or you win the entire game if you get the right thing. So we're going to play one match with him and then one match without him. Then as far as the rest of the deck goes, I think the next six cards are pretty much staples for Luke. You've got the light tank, which is great at pushing. You've got the Gagoran rebel, which is amazing. Can just melt walkers. And then you've got the Grenader. you got to use this. This is like a lightsaber. Splash damage can take out masses of amounts of units. you got the Marauders, which also can take down walkers. you got the Wookiee, which is high health. And then this is your staple trooper card. Now, some of the variations of the deck, they'll swap out Old Ben for the Gunk Droid. Or like what Snowfire is doing is he's using the X-Wing. So let's go into battle the first time. And we're going to use Old Ben. And we're just going to use it. We're just going to see how it works. Even if we come across somebody that is not playing those cards that I was talking about. But I just want to show you how it works and how it works in battle. Okay, we'll be right back as soon as it cues. All right, we're going against Jedi Nightmare. So I was, I'm kind of glad to see this matchup. I was kind of worried that I was going against Bosk, 
with his snare or Darth Vader, which is just super tanky. So I'm feeling pretty good about this. So what we're going to do is we're going to let the energy build up and we're going to drop it all the way in the back. Now, I've been told that you can actually go beyond 10 to like 10 and a half, but I have mine on auto set. So it did drop at 10 and I'd rather have that in the back. Now, I'm going to stand here in the front and then I'm going to stop walking. So if he sends any units, I can reflect. He did not. All right, we're going to drop the Wookiee. And then we're going to drop the Grenader in the, in the, right in front of that. All right, what's, uh, let's see. Let's see if we can reflect some damage. Okay, let's drop this Yeti. All right, I'm going to reflect some damage. All right. All right, let's back up a little bit. And we're going to drop unit there. All right, he dropped the walker, so we're dropping the marauders, and we gotta, we gotta just go at it right here. Oh man, he uh, used his ability, which is speed up. All right, oh he stunned me too, so I'm, I, I'm gonna die. I'm dead. Ugh. Not very good at playing Luke. If I'm being honest, I'm just not good at playing him. That's the truth. Um. I know he's amazing. I just haven't got him figured out yet. I mean, like I said, I dropped like four or 500 points. And there definitely is a pretty steep learning curve on how to use them. Now, I think what's going to happen in this battle right here is that they are not playing the cards that I think are worth stealing with Ben. But if I'm going to lose, I'll probably just play it anyways. All right, let's back up a little bit. All right. Oh, let's save that. Let's uh, get back up to 10 energy before I drop that. All right, here we go. Oh, they dropped a walker right in the front. Ugh. And he does the speed up. Oh, that's so broken. Oh, boy. Oh, back up. See there, I should be able to tower push. I just never know when to do it. All right, well... Let's take out this group right here. Oh, the Yeti is so strong. It's not a Yeti. I know it's called something else. Okay. Oh, my goodness. This is not good at all. Okay, I'm going to use Old Ben right here and see if this saves anything. Okay. I did get one unit, so that was not a good value. But I just wanted to show you how that worked. All right, come on. Let's go. Let's go over here. Let's uh, rush the tower. Oh, he stunned me. See, if he didn't stun me, I could have went and got the energy, but he stunned me. So that is the way it goes. So, ah, not so well. We lost that one there. That's the way it goes. I will play him more, or I may make a sequel to this video to give you some insight on how to play him well. I know that it's amazing. But I haven't figured out. There, I lost 31 points. Okay, unlock available. Let's open that card right there. And we'll unlock that. We're going to swap out old man. And we're going to put in the X-Wing. And we're going to give that a go. Okay, we'll be back after it queues. All right, we got a battle. And we're going up against the same hero. Let's see if this goes better now that I have Old Ben out of my deck. The thing about Old Ben is you can only drop him, and it's a big commitment, 8 energy. And if you don't use him, then you don't have the ability of cycling through cards to react to whatever they're doing. Okay, so we're going to go stand up here, like right here, and stop walking. If he sends any units my way, I'll be able to reflect them. Let's drop the tank way in the back. Oh, boy. It dropped two units. What a waste. Oh, at least take them out. All right. Well, that wasn't so bad. All right. I will... That's not a good start, honestly. Let's do the Yeti. Oh, boy. All right. Let's uh, take out that guy. Let's see if he stuns me or not. All right. All right. Let's suicide the tower. This went much better. And then I'll grab the energy. He's targeting me, so let's go get some energy. And then we'll run out of there. Stole his energy, if nothing else. I need more, though. All right, this is going better. Let's uh, drop a unit right there. Let's do a strike. 
Well, that ended his push right there. All right, we got something going down below. Let's take out that unit. All right, jump troopers. Let's run away from them. Leader defeated. Boy. All right, let's uh, slow down and we'll do another push here. And we'll push the bottom lane. Light tank in the back. Let's uh, go stand right here. And if he drops a unit, we'll be able to reflect. Oh, he's going top. All right, let's counter that with a little bit of units. Don't want to lose this tower easily. Let's wipe out as many as we can. Oh, look at that. All right, let's get out of here. Let's push the bottom. All right, let's go steal this health pack back here. Just at least to take it from him. Uh-oh. Uh, two towers down. Yay. All right, what do I want to do here? Let's see. Let's do an X-Wing and just take out his hero. <laughs> All right, let's drop a tank. We'll push the, the base a little bit more. we got 51 seconds left in the match. Good game. All right, looks like he's already given up. We got... Uh, See, old Ben would have been getting against this guy. He's actually running the unit that I could win with. You know, the 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 light tank. I don't ever see that card very often. All right, and we won. Well, let me know what you think about Luke. But he is one of the best heroes in the game by far. Uh, obviously, there's a lot of top 10 players that are using Luke. I've been destroyed by Luke a lot. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching the video. Be sure to give a thumbs up if you got something out of it. And as always, thanks for watching and keep on gaming.